guys welcome back to my channel today I wanted to share with you a quick what's in my bag for work um, as you guys may have known those of you that have followed me on Instagram or seen my last video I started a new job they required me to take a little more than I normally do I am a medical assistant still but I'm afloat so that means I go to all different clinics and I no longer have a quote-unquote home clinic so there's a few items that I have to bring with me. I just wanted to sit down and share that with you guys. So here we go. Hope you enjoy. Thanks for watching. Alrighty guys, so this is the bag that I bring to work with me every day. It is a book bag. I got it on Amazon. It is freaking heavy. So I'm gonna as I'm showing you guys. What I have in here, I think I'm going to downsize because I know I am an overpacker. I can't help it. I know I'm just taking way more than I need to. But it is from the brand Him Himawari. I got it on Amazon. And let's start with the outside. So on the handles here, I have a hand sanitizer, Bath and Body Works. It is a purple rain. It's really cute. It smells good. It smells really good is what I meant to say. Um, I have it in this pink uh, glittery handle here. And I have my AirPods Pro hanging off of it. Um, I don't normally leave them there. But I just don't want to forget them in the morning. Because I have left without them. And it's just a reminder when I get to work I just slip them in my pockets. But I leave that there in, in the evening. The, let's start with the outer pockets. On this side, I just have a water bottle. This is from Brita. I really, really like this brand, this bottle. It has a nice um, filter, so it, even if you have to use tap water, it filters it nicely. So this is my water bottle. It has a nice handle here. I'll put that to the side. There shouldn't be anything else. No, there's not. One thing I will tell you is if you put a water bottle in here, nothing else will fit and it will like smush whatever is inside on this side. So just be careful. On this side, um, this is here you could put like a charger in here. So you can charge a device, your phone more than likely, but I've never used it. But it's great that that feature is there. I just haven't had a need for it. On this side, I have my... Osmo uh, DJI pocket camera. I like to use this for vlogging. So I keep that in there. And I keep my car keys. So I'll park, get on, and just slip my car my keys in there. So this is my uh, Louis Vuitton six ring key holder. I have that there. Just keep my car keys on the outside because it's actually too big to fit inside. So I just leave them out. I don't think I have anything else in there. Oh, I do actually. I have the my lock for my locker. I have been lucky enough that the two clinics I've gone to so far, I've been provided a locker, so I just keep this with me. The key is on my badge. Uh, you won't see my badge in here because I keep it in my car because I'm scared to death to lose it. Without my badge, I can't get into the parking garage and I can't uh, swipe in, obviously. So. I don't want to forget it. Um, so that was the side pockets. In the front, in this big pocket, it's pretty spacious actually. This pocket's pretty spacious right here in front. I do have a stain from the um, hand sanitizer. My son was playing with it and it's a lot spilled out. And I can't get that stain in. It's irritating me. This, but like I said, this pocket is pretty dang roomy. And I will show you guys what I have in there right now. I have the, the charging brick for my uh, iPad Pro. I have this case. I actually ordered an AirPod Pro case. And this bad boy came with it. I really like it. And in here, I keep charging cables. I have... I actually have headphones because uh, since I'm new I have to do a lot of trainings and a lot of them are online so I have to listen to them on the computer 
so they said to bring headphones i do have my airpods but some of the computers aren't uh bluetooth compatible for some reason they're really old so i have to uh, hook up my um earbuds to it but i have my uh, iPhone charger, Apple charger, my Apple charger. <laughs> I have my iPhone charger, my Apple Watch charger, and my um, iPad charger. So, just like to be prepared. So those are there. I have my toothbrush paste, all that. Um, toothpicks, brain fart. Sorry. I have a uh, hand sanitizer, I have wet ones, it's a really nice hydroluronic acid hydrating hand cream, rose water from Bath and Body Works, really nice. Uh, a rep gave this to me, it is a um, uh, straw actually, a reusable straw really nice and it has the cleaner so yay to saving the environment my coin purse from New York coins another chapstick I have I love this case from Conair. I got this at Walgreens. Bobby pins, but I keep hair ties in it as well. And I have this uh, phone stand. For a long time, I didn't have a pop socket on my phone, but I would have that stand with me. So that's it for that pocket. Like I said, it holds a lot. this nicely organized what happened there we go stand up stand up okay now the main compartment there you go this has um a sleeve for your laptop or your tablet and then another smaller sleeve here and then on the other side, there is uh, a zipper compartment and two pockets. So let's start with this side since we're here. In the zipper, nice. In the zipper here, we have uh, two pads and um, eyeglass cleaner. You can clean your phone too, but. I mean, for my glasses is what I got it for. I can't stand dirty eyeglasses. I have in the pockets, I have two headbands. In this one, I just have my school ID. It's just attached in there. And again, another thing I don't want to forget because we do have to scan ourselves into the building. On the other side, the I sometimes take my laptop with me. It's rare, I don't really take it as often. But what I do carry is my iPad Pro. This is the 11 inch iPad Pro. So I just have this with the plain black case that holds the pencil. And, oh, I'll just take it out. Since I am brand new and still orienting, I have a whole bunch of documents, uh, policies, procedures, stuff like that. That I need to go, you know, that's to still learn and stuff. So you can see there, this pocket, then this second one. I'll show you that bag when it's empty. Mm. Now for the main compartment here, I have my MDF stethoscope holder. I got this off of Amazon and let me tell you I did not expect it to be this big. This sucker is huge, 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 huge. 
But with that said, let's open her up. There you go. This is what I have in here. I have the Lipman Classic 3 stethoscope, all black. In the sleeve here, I have my scrub cap from Maven. It is clean. I just washed it. The next two things I carry, you may not need them, but I find that I need them as a float. Um, you know, due to COVID, everything is, they're trying to do all digital temperature checks. And every department seems to have one digital thermometer for each MA. And it's sometimes hard to find someone and like hunt them down and get their borrow theirs. So I'm like, you know what? I just invested in one for myself. And I really, really like it. Just put it right to your forehead. Hmm. These can't be accurate. 96.3. That can't be right. But I don't know what it is about digital thermometers that the temperature is so much lower. And I also did get an oxygen uh, meter. I got another thing that sometimes if I don't have the Dynamap, I have to hunt down people for it. I do keep my stethoscope because some patients have requested I check their blood pressure manually. And obviously for that you need a, um, a stethoscope. Going on. Next thing I have is my agenda. Now this I put together myself. I got the clear agenda from the binder I should say from Amazon. I have my leopard print ollie clip. There's a whole bunch of stuff here, but a lot of it is really personal, so I can't really show you guys. But yep, this is my planner. Just quick jot stuff down. New clinics that I'm assigned to, phone numbers, all that stuff is in here, so I need that. Oh, I'll that later. Um, what else? I have toothpaste and toothbrush in here, um, toothpicks, mouthwash, you never know, depending what you eat. My I Love New York coin purse, got this in New York, coins, another native deodorant, I don't know why I have two, I shouldn't have two, but okay. Um, Hyaluronic, hyaluronic acid hydrating hand cream from Bath and Body Works. This is um, rose water. It smells divine. Oh my god, it smells so good, you guys. Oh, I went from going inside to the outside, didn't I? <laughs> this is open. Sorry, er, rewind. Okay. Things started rolling. I didn't close this, so stuff started rolling out, and I just started doing that. Should we just continue with the front pocket then? <laughs> ah, sorry, guys. I got distracted. I'm easily distracted.
So the next thing I have are my masks here, and I have a uh, surgical, an N95, and what is this one? I think it's the KN95. Oh, but it's a little different. They're just two different N95 masks that they gave me at my last uh, clinic. So I just keep them in here. Now we have to wear two masks every day. You have to wear the N95 and then the surgical one on top. So I keep that. And I have my pencil pouch from Poi and Hun. Standard pens, highlighters, uh, sharpies. I have a um, portable charger just in case I need it. Uh, my makeup bag. And here I have a whole bunch of crap. This can definitely be condensed. So let's see. I have a rollerball DKNY perfume. My sustained eye drops because I have severe, severe dry eyes. So I have a rechectable kabuki from Sonia Kashuk. I've had this for years. For some reason, two chapsticks. I think one's supposed to go in my car. I keep a native mini deodorant. This is the coconut vanilla. It smells pretty good. I have my Bare Minerals uh, Compact. It's nice just for touch-ups. I don't wear too much makeup. I mean, we're wearing masks all day, but still. Oh, my Instant A for wine uh, eraser for, of dark circles. This is like at the end. Oh no. I'm almost done. I so I've been using this sucker for years. I, Please don't ever, ever, ever just continue at Maybelline. Um, I have mascara, Total Temptations, an eyeliner from Maybelline, ultra slim brow, brow pencil from Maybelline. Dang, everything's from Maybelline, huh? <laughs> Happy accident. A Bobbi Brown lipstick, a nice like brown, like pinkish brown. This is the color. Crushed. It's really pretty. I have tweezers. I have scissors for some reason. I have my blush, my favorite blush from NARS. Um, deep throat. A whole bunch of hair ties. Ooh, pelo. Um, and breast strips because nobody wants a stanky breast. Um, Eyeliner, I believe this is Maybelline as well. <laughs> I really love the curve curvature. I think that's what it's actually called curvature. Which really nice. And I guess a whole bunch of hair ties. I do keep a little notebook and this I keep in the pocket of my scrub jacket or in the leg of my scrub pants because as someone new I'm going to new clinics all the time I need to take notes like what are their codes for their doors their uh, just certain doctors like things a certain way they like certain things charted so this is very handy this is like my little Bible no joke an umbrella I want to get a smaller one I need to get a smaller one this is actually really heavy and I, I need to have one because while while I do keep an eye on the temperature you just just never know when mother nature is gonna shit her pants and I park pretty far away so don't want to get caught I got booty wipes if you want to stay fresh my wallet is the uh, Louis Vuitton Victorine wallet cute little like trifold that's so cute wallet and then oh a dime lucky money money 
inside we also have a kind of like a water bottle pocket in here i'm not sure if you can see that in there there i keep food i keep snacks oh i keep a hairbrush in here Oh my. <laughs> I have another lotion, Bath and Body Works Rose. I have extra gum. I have a Z bar cliff bar for kids. I have an Octavia a cranberry honey nut granola bar. Yes, I have started the Octavia. Uh, diet. I do keep, I think I have more than one of these. Yeah. I have these crystal lights on the go if I want to add just a little flavor to my water. Uh, pink lemonade. And I think that's it, you guys. So there. The cleaner, easier look inside the bag. One of, if not the best things I purchased while I started um, this job as a float was the Apple Smart Battery Case. This, you guys, is amazing. I did purchase this um, like kickstand for it. The pop sockets, I have not found one that will stick to the silicone for some reason. So I got this like metallic one. And it is um, magnetic because I have the magnetic thing in my car to like attach it but seriously this is the best thing it is hard to find somewhere to charge your phone as a float because you know, all the stations are taken you don't want to leave your uh, charger there because you just don't know people so yep it's like having two full batteries it's I basically have two batteries every day so right now, they're both at 100%. And what's nice about it is that if um, once the battery starts dying, what starts dying first is the case. And then your actual phone battery starts getting used up. So I have left work at 5 with the case being at 30% and my phone still at 100%. I have left where um, the phone battery, not the phone battery, the smart battery is at zero and my phone would be like 92% at 5 o'clock. It really depends on how much you're using your phone, obviously. And that's that. Again, not, not sponsored at all, but this is just, this was a really great investment. They're expensive, but they're worth it especially if you're not one to upgrade your phone all the time if you upgrade your phone every year that there's no one then i don't recommend it it is a waste of money unless you sell it and with that money buy a new one then i guess it's worth it but if you get a new phone every year they're expensive they're like 130 i got it for 60 bucks on amazon refurbished and it is you guys it, it's the best thing ever but 
anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video you maybe found something that maybe you should be taking with you some things that i need to take out of here i'm gonna go through that right now as we were going through the bag together i just like feel like i need all of this and i probably don't need not even a fraction of it but i just have to mentally prepare for what i don't need because i am one of those rainy day take the entire kitchen sink with you because the moment you take it out you're gonna need it it's happened to me so i'm like in my mind i'm in my head about it take it out leave it take it out leave it oh god i don't know what to do but yeah that's okay i that is my mental struggle and even though i have this and i don't need to take all my chargers with me i still do because this happened to me where i thought i plugged it in the charger in at night and i didn't push it in all the way and the battery case was dead and my phone was dying my phone was at about 40 percent in the morning and the battery case was completely dead i didn't plug it in push it in all the way so i like to just be prepared with my plugs and my chargers and all that stuff that's me that's just my just how my brain works guys I'm, I'm just so neurotic that's the word i'm neurotic about things and i can't help it my husband will tell you i'm a pain in the ass like that <laughs> so uh yes anyways thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed today's video please be sure to give it a thumbs up like subscribe comment down below something you think that girl take that out you don't need it or you know what you're missing something <laughs> no don't tell me i'm missing something because y'all see i already take too much with me so thank you again so much for watching i truly truly appreciate it uh, thank you all for all the love you guys have been showing on my videos and yes like i said there is i didn't want to show my face too much in this one because a girl is looking jacked um but yep I know I'm vain. It's okay. I had a minute. Uh, yeah, but that's it. All right, guys. For the third time, thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one.